But no, uh, I do want to thank you very much for submitting your uh, graphical presentation of what you think a police car should look like. I think you brought a picture with you or a plaque. Hold that up for us to see. So, uh, Council, if you haven't seen the new police car, um, John submitted the winning uh, graphic presentation of what he thought the police car should look like. And we had about 20 submittals, I believe. Is that right, Chief? And John was the winner. And there's a picture of him uh, with a plaque that he was presented at Mellon Middle School. John, we appreciate your participating in that. And I understand that on the back of the police car is your signature. Is that right? Yes. Yeah. You're proud of that? Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, so how old are you, John? 13. 13. Oh, it's a square. We need to correct that. Okay, well, we want to make sure that that's correct. And I just want you to know that uh, it's channel 27 now. Not 7. I have to get out of that habit. So you take cable at home? Okay, so when they air the council meetings on channel 27, guess who's going to be on the TV? You. Standing there at the podium telling us how to pronounce your name and the fact that we had your age wrong. And you're looking at the camera now. You can wave to your mother and father. <laughs> well, I think that's a great thing. I commend the police department for taking that action. Uh, and I guess you'll be trying to drive in about three years. Is that right? Yes. So you better be real careful. It would be kind of embarrassing for have the police car that you signed <laughs> <laughs> stop you someplace in town, would That would be funny. <laughs> well, thank you very much, and so let's give him a round of applause.